Hello Simmers, this is the final part of the speed build of Saltbox Wonder. Um, so we're just continuing on here in the bathroom, it's the master bathroom, upstairs. I'm just placing some uh, towel racks, hand towel racks on the mirrors, and a plant, and the candles. I actually haven't tested to see if you can actually light those candles uh, like you could in The Sims 3. I'm about to check that out. And just some decal on the wall. I know that's a, a kid thing, but I like it. <laughs> Placing a master bed. Um, and end tables to go with it. And just some lamps for the table. And a plant in the room on each side. I guess way too big for this bedroom. <laughs> there we go. There's a lot of room in here. So I'm going to put a fireplace and a chair. Um, just to help fill some of the space. Um, and just go with that green olive green to match the lanterns. Just use the same plant again on each side. And we'll just go ahead and put a TV in here as well. And the same painting on the wall uh, in the different colors. And then we'll do the same. those two and remove that and put the black one on this side as well. And let's put a railing along. Try to look for a darker color but I couldn't find that. And then the upstairs entertainment area. So I debated what I wanted to put up here the whole time I was building. Um, I was like, I'll just put some chairs and the TV so that the girls can have a, a getaway from the adults um, or vice versa. Just getting these chairs to make an L shape and put a little table in between. And just put another one actually on the other side and then I'll change the colors so that it's not too it's not so much orange and we'll just only have one orange chair for uh, just a little splash of color I think I'll go back and change the chairs again to have a black border on them change that end table and this is when I change the chairs with that black border so it'll match the at least part of it will match that table. Just put that in there for some music and a rug and then an orange one and some lighting. I didn't really have anything to put in that corner up there, so I just put some plants. Um, and I'll do that in a minute. I put two little TVs in the girls' rooms. And a runner in the hallway. Alright, 
So now we can start focusing a little bit on outside. Um, I'm not very good with landscaping either, but it turned out really well. Took a little playing around with it. quite know what I wanted to do. in the pathway to the front of the house. And just shorten that up a little bit. It was too far out. And get a tree in there. I just decided to fill all of the space in there um, and put more of the lavender on the other side. And then just fill this one as well with the lavender and the regular shrubs. And then pathway. And a fountain. A little bit of flowers on the bottom of it. So it kind of looks a little overgrown. And just up the house on Some stairs to go up. I started putting the stairs down, and then I was like, well, I should have a um, deck that has an outdoor seating area. So I just added it beside it and I removed the railing on the stairs and just added this. And just me starting to put the pool in. And I just gave it a little shape which what I start off with, I change it up a little bit. I'm going to make it a little bit larger and um, give that part not so pointed. <laughs> Just bring everything out. frame around the pool with some tiling. That forward one so I can place a patio chair or a table and some chairs so that they can eat since they won't fit on the um, deck upstairs. I'll fill it with everything. <laughs> and these turtles are so cute, so I put them swimming like they were swimming with their kids. <laughs> put 
lighting on the pool. Change it to night so I can kind of see that it lights it up. And I just jumped off to doing changing the roofing um, some more plants on the side And this is me finally decorating the deck. Um, as you see, there was no room on there. So I just placed it. And the grill. And I'll just put the table and or the um, counters and the uh, fridge here so that they don't have to go all the way inside to get food and a sink to clean up at and the trash can I was trying to figure out what on what side of the house I wanted to put this thing on I was like the front's too too crowded and we'll just put it right there chairs there and some more plants for the um, outdoors and I made a I like putting the two cherry trees there because I kind of make it made an arch so I put a chair underneath it and a fountain a small little fountain with the birds on it I like that I was going to put that uh, fire pit there, and I was like, nah, that'll just obscure what that's for. And some plants by the pool. Adjust that up. A couple more of those. So everyone, that is my home salt box wonder. It's available on the gallery for download in the description and on how to find that. It's in the description below. Uh, please like my videos and uh, subscribe. Thank you for watching. And up will help you the pictures as well.